up y'all it's your boy dj fanatic from djfanaticbeats.com welcome to a special video i just wanted to jump on camera man and talk about the sound advice tour uh, my experience from the sound advice tour from kato on the track kato the producer and uh it was a great experience uh, before i get into it if you haven't subscribed click the sub button click the bell as well so you're alerted to new videos and also if you like the video and i say something super dope give it a thumbs up just hit that like button so i know that you exist and that you support the channel uh like i said in other videos man i'm getting thousands of views and not everybody's supporting it by subbing man so click the sub and i thank you for watching and of course i got tons of beats uh <laughs> djfanaticbeats.com and i got tons of sounds and drum kits and what not a ton of them but you know a lot of quality stuff at soundsforproducers.com for all my producers that watch this video and my other videos as well so let me get into it the sound advice tour um basically is a tour where kato's touring i don't know the exact number i think it's like 38 maybe more uh cities or areas uh up and down the country east coast i believe he went west coast too i think he went to cali and maybe vegas I know he's going to Canada too, he went to Atlanta, he went to New York, you know, up and down the East Coast, and this past Thursday was here in the D.C. area, Maryland, Virginia, and D.C. area, so I thought it was dope that I attended, um, being that I actually met Cato for the first time, I think last year, at the beginning of last year in Austin, Texas, at the BeatStars uh, headquarters there, and I did an in-studio collab with him, which was dope, um, shout out to BeatStars, the whole BeatStars fam, shout out to A, Mike, um dev and um everyone else that i know from beat star shout out to dj pain one had a bunch of collabs with dj pain one and um also cash money ap had a collab with him and also dream life so yeah the whole beat stars fam man much love to y'all but uh back to the sound advice tour man shout out to all the producers from this area that attended as well there's just so much talent in this area man it's crazy and also thank you to the uh producer that actually made the ig group for that i really appreciate it man i'm gonna look you up and call you out on camera uh, i'm not sure if you watch my channel but um if you do you know that um you're being called out <laughs> on this video and i'm gonna make this quick you know i know i get winded a lot with certain videos when i'm talking on camera and i haven't did a video like this on the dj fanatic beats channel in a while where i just talk and it's always not always but it's usually just beats or like new topics in the producer community or whatever so or just new topics that are related to my brand so uh shout out to let me get to it right quick ig has so many f new features man and who made it who made this group let me go all the way up because y'all been chatting in this group all day man i'm still scrolling i knew that's good though communication is important you know whether you're a producer or not you know communication makes things a lot clearer and a lot more um greg's golden greg's golden voice yeah he had a super deep voice man greg greg's gold voice follow him at ig if you like to he created the sound advice group for the washington dc area which was a dope idea man so thank you i really appreciate that so we can stay in touch and network and whatnot um so yeah um like i was saying i met kato like last year and we did it in studio and he just always gave good advice man like from the heart and based on his experiences and i connect with his story as well you know about how long he has been grinding you know about the the struggle that he's been through in the early days you know like before he could uh like basically before music took over and was able to like sustain his living conditions you know what i mean instead of working a nine to five the rest of your life until retirement and then you die you know what i'm saying <laughs> oh i got retirement and i didn't follow my dreams or whatever he followed his dreams and through many obstacles um you know he prevailed and i can totally connect with that because right now i don't know if you know because i put out a lot of content i'm still in the cube man i'm working a nine to five in a cube and 
it's breaking my heart to be honest it's, i feel like it's killing my soul because all i want to do is make music and be an entrepreneur but there was a lot of things that Cato touched on that connects to that he was saying basically you can get a nine to five that um this doesn't work for me because of my living style and I'm a little older and I have other expenses, but you can get like a job that doesn't require as much as your time. That that way you can put a lot of your time into your business, into being on camera, into making content, into, you know, uh, structuring your business and all, all that kinds of stuff. You can just put more energy into it. Um, so but that doesn't work for me, but I think it's a good idea for like younger uh, producers. But also what he said that touched me was like, when you're done with that nine to five, the real work begins. He said it's something to that extent. And I, I just wanted to like speak on that because every day, man, like even after your nine to five, you don't want to do nothing. You cook and you might be able to hear my little one in the background. You got to take care of family. You know, you, you got to do things that you're exhausted she really wants to be on camera, man. Jeez. And we're keeping her off social media right now. So, and she's like staring at me through the window. It's crazy. Love you too. Hey, love you. <laughs> All right. So let me keep recording, man. Um, and you'll hear her in the background. <laughs> and I don't care, man. I'm going to air this. I'm going to publish this. This life, man. And... I wish I could put it on camera, but yeah, we're gonna keep her on social media for now. But I'm gonna sample some of her vocals and, and put them in beats and stuff. So, yeah, yeah, I got some ideas, man. But um, but yeah, after that nine to five, you put in that work. You know, the real work begins when you get home. You know, do your priority stuff: make dinner, get your clothes ready, get your little kids ready, whatever. You know, spend some time with your significant other, whatever, and then dedicate that time into your business you know weekends you got more time i got more time on weekends um i don't know it, it just really connected with me because i'm like some days i just don't want to do it but it's dedication you know it, it's you're dedicated to being to running your business to being successful and i just wanted to thank Cato, man for that type of advice because it connected with me uh, not only just that, it's just tons of stuff uh, that he shared with other producers and the all, of course, all the videos and whatnot, uh, because it's impactful. You know, it's shaping, it's helping the community. And whenever I see like genuine, um, what do you call it? Uh, genuine and, and sound advice. Um, I think it's it's impactful because we're not in this alone. Like producers, man, you know, I'm speaking to my producers now. Uh, we're different type of people. You know, um, we're, I don't know if it's left brain, that's art, artistic or whatever. Uh, I think it's a left brain, but we're like that. We, we like to create, we like to do things differently. And when you have that creative aspect, just smothered, it, we can't, we don't feel free. You know what I mean? We don't feel like we're, we're being used in a way. You know, used in a good way. It's like, you know, you're in this life for a reason and you're not being used for your greatest gift. You know what I mean? So I don't want to get too deep on a video, but the Sound Advice Tour was dope. Uh, we basically, you know, a bunch of local producers. We uh, got into like a studio room. Uh, Kato introduced himself and it was dope, man. He just kind of spoke on a couple things, um, especially with the... Um, song trust and about you know registering your music and whatnot and royalty stuff and all that talked briefly on that and also took some general questions for about uh, an hour or so and that was cool as well so i mean i've been listening to to that for a long time but it's always great to hear um you know refresh your memory and also to hear again because it can get confusing sometimes man the business side of it but, you know, you don't know the business side of it. You're kind of shooting yourself in the foot. So you got to know both ends. Um, so what else am I going to talk about? Yeah, those are the things that came to mind um, that reached me as a creative. And also posting. Um, 
I'm really proud of myself that I've been posting so much, um, not just on YouTube, but also on my other accounts. If you haven't followed me on wait, Instagram, I was about to say, <laughs> if you haven't followed me on Instagram, follow me at DJ underscore fanatic, P-H-A-N-A-T-I-C underscore beats, or just type in DJ fanatic beats in the search field. I will pop up. Trust me. Um, for my producers, if you want loop sounds, MIDI data, drum kits, follow me on Instagram as well at Sounds for Producers. Also, SoundsForProducers.com if you want to grab something right quick. And the Cayenne Pack. If you uh, type in Sounds for Producers slash Cayenne, C A Y E N N E, I think it's two N's in Cayenne, uh, you'll see that uh, free loop pack as well. So, yeah, man, the Sound Advice Tour is dope. I'm all very happy for Kato. I'm very, um, I don't know, man, it, to do a tour like that, I know it's exhausting. I had never traveled that much in sequence. I traveled a lot in college doing like band trips and choir trips, but to do something like that, it, I don't know, man, that, that's a lot of, a lot of on planes and making calls and whatnot. So I think it's a beautiful thing. But I uh, commend them for, you know, sticking it through and, and doing this type of thing for the community. I think it's awesome, man. And I just want to give a special shout out to the producers that I know uh, that were there from our Beat Stars meetup. Um, for any producers that watch this, you know, I'm a Beat Stars ambassador for the last couple of years, man. And and you see it in the background, my first dad hat from Beat Stars. Thanks, Mike. Um, but yeah, uh, shout out to We Need Capital. It's your boy Bear, uh, Jay Reed's Knocking, and Marvelous Beats. It's cool to see y'all there just soaking in the knowledge and presenting your music. And, um, you know, it's a small community, man. We all in it together. I'm still speaking to the producers, but I know a lot of y'all watch my stuff, man. So thank y'all for your support. And if you haven't subscribed, you know, click the sub button and, and show your love. I definitely appreciate it. Um, and for my artists out there, Anything that helps you get out there more, whether it's in your local city or you got to drive a little bit or you got to fly. I say focus where you are, you know, because there's so many things popping. You want to get your face out there. You want to get your voice out there. You want to get your style out there. You want to get other producers interested in you to make you some music and vice versa. So get yourself out there. And and even if, you know, you got to pay some money for a couple of these things, it's worth it, man because you're putting yourself out there you can't always just sit back and think something's going to happen just keep jumping out there keep putting yourself out there keep doing things that you never done before switch it up go at it you know what i mean don't that's someone that's dedicated there's a difference between someone that's thinking about it and wishing it and then actually doing it when you do it you're declaring i'm here listen to me you know what i mean i, I said i wasn't gonna get too deep so anyway I'm out of here. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. And again, if you want some dope beats, you rap or sing, you know, you want better quality music, you want to get notoriety with your music, start right now by downloading some dope beats at djfanaticbeats.com. I'll put a um, link in the description for some free beats for you. Enjoy it. Make something dope. And of course, click the bell as well so you're alerted to new videos on the channel. Have a dope weekend for those that are having a long weekend and don't have to work on Monday. And, uh, yeah, stay true to yourself and keep pushing. Peace and love. DJ Fanatic signing out. See you next time. Peace.